now let's see about directory implementation uh, we know what is a directory a directory means a collection of files uh, we use directories mainly to organize the files uh, there are two approaches in order to implement a directory the first approach is linear list the second approach is hash table so let's see what is a linear list so linear list means here we maintains uh, a list of file names with pointers to the data blocks so we know what is a data block here the hard disk is divided into several blocks uh, and in those blocks the file information will be stored so we can say that the files are stored in the blocks the data blocks of the hard disk so linear list means we maintains a, a linear list of file names and those file names points to the corresponding data blocks uh, so here uh, what will happen is uh, whenever we want to create a file uh, then first operating system will check whether is there is any file with that name or not uh, for that it performs the searching in a linear fashion or one by one so let us assume that we have 100 files present in the directory then first it search whether new file is same as the first file or not if it is not same then it checks whether new file is uh, uh, new file is same as second file or not next it checks whether new file is same as third file or not so likewise it will search for all the 100 files so if the new file is not similar to all those 100 files then it creates a file with that name as a 101 file so likewise for searching operation also it will take more amount of time we have 100 files so it will check it will search for the first file next for the second file next for the third file so likewise for deletion operation also it will take more amount of time why because all the files are searched in linear fashion one by one one by one so the major advantage of this approach is uh, it is very very simple to implement this approach so simply we have to maintain a list and that list points to an entry that entry points to the corresponding data block so it is very very simple to implement this approach but the major disadvantage of this approach is it is very very time consuming process why because here the searching is done in linear fashion one by one we can overcome this problem with the help of the second approach the second approach is hash table here hash table means here also we are maintaining a linear list only so linear list of file names with pointers to the data blocks but hashing is used for searching here instead of using linear search here we are using hashing technique we know the major advantage of hashing by using hashing we can perform the searching operation in a constant computing in a constant computing time so that means with the help of only one comparison we can perform the searching if you take uh, linear search then the worst case time complexity is big o of n if you take binary search then the worst case time complexity is big o of log n whereas if you take hashing then the time complexity is big o of 1 so that means uh, uh, with the help of only one comparison we can uh, search for the corresponding file so here what is hash table here here also in order to implement the directory we are maintaining a linear list of files and those files points to the corresponding data blocks uh, but here instead of using linear search we are using binary search i'm sorry here we are using what hashing technique uh, so let's see we know how hashing is applied here actually what will happen is uh, every file uh, has some identifier whenever we create a file then internally an identifier will be created that, that file so hashing is applied on that file so hashing produces a hash value that value is mapped to an entry in the hash table so the corresponding value that corresponding hash value will be stored in a location of the hash table but here the problem is that uh, sometimes there may be a possibility that uh, more than one key or more than one value map to the same location of the hash table so that situation is known as collision so whenever we implement hashing then there is a possibility that collision may occur so whenever collision occur then we have to handle the collision in order to handle the collision we have several approaches like uh, linear probing quadratic probing double hashing extensible hashing but here the best technique is uh, separate chaining okay separate chaining means we have to maintain a linked list in the corresponding uh, entries okay so that if collision occurs then we can create a second node and uh, place uh, the second node address in the first node next field 
and if uh, if a collision occurs one more time in a corresponding entry then uh, create the third node and store that node address in the second node next field so likewise we can handle the collision okay so the major advantage of this approach is that uh, we know the the advantage of the hashing it produces searching operation in a constant computing time that is nothing but in only one comparison so by using these two ways we can implement uh, directories linear list as well as hash table so this is about directory implementation